Jeff the General here with another quick tip. Okay, in this video, I'm gonna show you the best way to upload your songs to YouTube. I'm gonna show you one with an image and the other with a short video clip that you can always have on loop while your song is playing. If you like what you see, like what you hear, feel free to subscribe, like, and share. Hit that notification button so you know when your boy's coming through. Let's get creative. All right. Here's my image calm. Calm is 1400 by 1400 in size. The reason why I mention that is because when you go to Canva, which is what we're using to create our first YouTube still image, go to Canva, click on video as your design uh, template, upload your image, place your image in the middle. Once you've done that, you're going to have two sides of background to play with. I don't like leaving the background as it is plain and white. And, you know, I like to fill that section up with either a color, you know, click on background tab, change the color, make it purple, red, whatever you feel fits your image. Uh, if I was to go with this image, for example, I can go to filter, uh, put some filter into it. When you're, once you're happy with your image, download it as a PNG, that's the best format. Once you've downloaded that image, then place it into your software. The software that I'll be using is Microsoft Windows uh, Movie Maker. So there's my image. I'm gonna drag and drop it into my Movie Maker. Now, let me minimize this for a second. The length of my song here is 3 minutes 44. So let's just say approximately four, four minutes. I'm going to create, make sure that my image, copy that, place my cursor at the end and make sure my image is the same length as my song. So in this case, I'm going to take that, control A to copy all of it, move my cursor to the end, paste that, control A to copy all of it again, so I'm going to keep doing this until my um, image is the same length as my song. All right, so that's my image at just over the length of my song at 3 minutes 58. I'm going to go to home, add music, put my, my song in there, go down to the bottom just to make sure everything's fine. As you can see, it's just a little bit over, so I can just delete that image there you know, and leave it as it is. That's now ready to go. I go to file, save my project as for high definition display. So when I do that, I can then name it calm video or, you know, whatever you want to call your song at the time and click save. That will now save the video and it's ready to upload. All right, there's a video. If I was to put it into my VLC, there you have it. That is your first video ready to go with a still image to upload to YouTube. I'm now gonna show you an, another way to do it, but with a video clip. This clip here, Rain, I got from Pixabay. Pixabay is a great royalty-free vector image video clip website. Um, close that. Once, you, once you've got your clip, go to Canva again and just go to the video section. Let's just take that out. Go to the video section here, and you can use any of Canva's video clips. Um, you can do that if you want to, but in this case, I'm just gonna use my own. So I'm gonna go to upload, go to the video section. Let me just click video, go that. I'm gonna um, upload rain, and I'm gonna place it on my template. And don't forget your template is 1980 by 1080p. Um, just give this a while to process. All right, so now I'm gonna take my video clip and place it right here in my template. Okay, that's good to go. I'm gonna to go to my, uh, go back to images and place my image right above the video. I can actually place it anywhere I want. I can be in the middle, it doesn't matter where you do it, but I want mine on the, on the left side of it. Um, just press play for a second. Okay, that's that. So in this case here, I don't see much of the video. Now, to, to, because I wanna see more of the video, I'm gonna highlight my, my image and I'm gonna reduce the transparency of this just enough so you can see the name of the song and the, the, uh, the name of the, uh, the artist. So let's make it about 85, press play. Because my clip had thunder and lightning going on, so I, I want that effect to come through on the cover. See, just like that. So I like all that. So once I'm happy with that, I then click download. All right, so I'm gonna put my new clip back into Movie Maker. The first thing I'm going to want to do is reduce the sound of my thunder and lightning I had going on in my clip. So you go to video tools, uh, video volume, turn that completely down. 
I'm going to want to extend the length of this clip again to 3 minutes 44 because that's the length of my song. Uh, control A to copy everything and just extend that. And, and look at that, 3 minutes 44. Okay, so what I'm going to do now is add my song, go to home, add music, put my calm in there. Okay, press play. Okay, that's good to go. Save movie as an HD file. Call that calm. All right, so there you have it with your two versions. Once you're ready with your song and video clip, just simply go to YouTube and upload your song to YouTube, put your tags in, put your description in. I don't use, um, I use Movie Maker because it's a free software, but feel free to use whatever you want. They tend to work in the same sort of way, depending on the complexity of your software. Um, there's my calm, upload that. You know, put your tags in, put your description in. So like I said, you know, use whatever, whatever software you're using, you can still, you know, achieve the same goals with your software. Uh, if you like what you see, if you like what you hear, feel free to subscribe, share, like, hit that subscribe button, and I will see you in the next video.